Hello everyone, my name is Jacquisto and welcome in this new episode of Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke Challenge. Let's go, okay. Oh shit, already a fight. Uh, I want to capture a Pokemon first. Okay, I cannot go there. You can just silence him, yell, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Okay, sure, sure, mate. Okay, let's go in the wild grass. Let's capture a Pokemon. Let's see, what do we got? Ah, no. Doesn't count, I already had it. I already had it, I mean. So, uh, nope. Run. Run away and find another one. Level 40 is though. Wow. Nice rod. Level, Pokemon level 40. That's cool. Okay, another one. Another one. Yes. What do we get? Oh. oh, oh. But see, that doesn't count. I had Brienne. She died. Rest in peace, Brienne. Press F. You will always be remembered. But, uh, had it already. Okay, another one. <laughs> is it these patches of grass? Are these patches of grass full of Pokemon I already have? Oh! Oh, that's cool! That's very cool! That's the, that's the little one that evolves in the, into the night, the night bug. That's cool, I love this design. Perfect, I like that. Nuzzle. Nice. That's cool. Okay, let's do a couple more nuzzles. That's enough, apparently. Careful with flail, that can be powerful. He was cured of paralysis. Oh, motherfucker. So I cannot paralyze him. Okay, whatever. I, I can still damage him. Should I use a second, another? Hmm, maybe I shouldn't. <clears throat> okay, cool, I like this one. And this is the one that you, in order to evolve, you, ex you have to exchange it with, uh, with the other one. There's another little bug with the... Uh, a helmet on it and you have to exchange the two and then they like they switch armor and they evolve into each other kind of it's hard to explain but uh, this one evolves to the knight and the other one evolves to the ninja nice I like that I didn't see if it was a male or a female though male nickname okay so okay uh, let's call him let's call him Jamie let's stay in uh, in the Game of Thrones themed medieval character names. We had Brienne, now we have Jamie. It sounds great, sounds great. Send to a box. Cool. Alright, time to beat the trainers. Whoop. As a model, I'll show off the appeal of my partner Pokemon. What I'm probably gonna do with the, the Carablast, with Jamie, calling Jamie. I'm probably gonna exchange it with uh, with a friend. I will find a friend who has uh, was the other one. I'm gonna exchange them so I can get the evolution straight away. I might not use it very often, at least in the beginning, because it has a four times weakness to uh, four times weakness to fire, which can be dangerous. So that's cool. One more steel Pokemon. It kind of replaces uh, Brienne in a way. All those steel Pokemons. And Lagatha, oh damn. I lost Brienne and Lagatha and I get two other steel Pokemons. This and Chao. Right, what can I do against uh, Vespiquen? Nothing much, right? Oh, I can... I'm stupid, I, sh I should just switch to uh, Cortex. And uh, one Rock Blast will... <laughs> Maybe just one single Rock Blast will be able to kill it. Maybe I don't think so. The, the Vespiquen has... Uh, they still have some some defense, I think. A little tanky, so I might need two rock blasts. <laughs> Let's see. One, yeah, two. Okay, that makes yeah makes more sense. I'm getting two carried on, carried away. Sorry. Easy anyway. What a great trainer you are. I know, I know. That's such an ugly. Makeup. <laughs> Another trainer. What's this type of trainer? I've never seen them before. Being a taxi driver. Oh, it's a <laughs> these are the the Corvinite taxi drivers. Okay, I I thought the the hat and the goggles made him look like a like a plane driver or something. But no, it makes sense. It makes sense. The Corvinite taxi flyer. Cool. A snipe shot again. Could have switched to uh, to Cortex again, but uh, that's fine. 
Damn, that's strong. I have a lot of special attack, I guess. I was about to say AP, but <laughs> I have a lot of AP. <laughs> like in League of Legends. Oh, this one is so cute. Let's snipe shot it. <laughs> it's like a... How do you call that? Duck hunt, you know? Like a duck target. Flying bird, flying bird. <laughs> cabbie. How is they call a cabbie? Of course. Taxi drivers are called cabbies in London. Or in the whole UK, I guess. Damn, there are pretty big Pokemon in those... In those grasses. Anything there? No, I don't think so. Ah, item here. Quick balls, yeah. Meh. Right. Oh, is the... Is the town already over? Oh no, it continues. Okay, route 8. <laughs> I was like, two trainers and a couple patch of grass. That's not much. Oh, that's cool. Are those like ruins? Oh, it's a shame I couldn't capture a Pokemon here. They sound interesting. They look quite interesting indeed. Uh, okay, cool. Several paths. I like that. Looks like a proper... Like a usual cave. Let me see, can I use someone else maybe? Let's switch to Mr. Boots. Mr. Boots wants to see some action. Oh, you're a doctor. Good for you, I guess. Yeah, perfect. I switched to Mr. Boots and here goes a poison Pokemon. That's another one shot. I only have Psybeam, I don't have Psychic yet. I thought I had Psychic already. Boom. Oh no, not one shot. Huh. I'm surprised. Poison Sting, oh my god, what a low level attack. It's one of those low level attacks that can still... Can still be very annoying because they are like... They don't do a lot of damage, but they can poison you and it's very frustrating and like... Such a shit attack, it still poisoned me. Still managed to get annoying. Another one? Hatrim. Oh, this one, yeah, I keep... I don't know why, I cannot remember this, the name of this Pokémon. Uh, I can switch to someone else. This is uh, this uh, fairy... Um, not fairy type, a uh, psychic type, so... Let's switch to Zed. Zed is fine. Some Shadow Ball. Let's get it over with. <laughs> I love using the uh, the leftovers on Z because you can get so much HP back each turn. That's ridiculous. I like Z. I like this Pokemon because he's tanky and he, do he does some decent damage. He's not like one of those weak tanks like uh, like they're not in this game, but. Uh, I forget the name. Uh, Chansey, the Chansey line. I forgot the name of all of them. Like they are, they are tanky and stuff, but they do shit damage, so it's a bit boring to use. Shiny stone. What's that again? A peculiar stone that makes certain pieces of Pokemon evolve. Which one? I've. I don't remember shiny stone to be fair. Uh, yeah, let's go there, I guess. Oh, some item here. <laughs> <laughs> like I use that ever. I'm exploring randomly and then I will see where else I can go. What is that Pokemon? Is it the Boldo? Oh, it's a Boldo, yeah. <laughs> I was seeing the Boldo from a, an unusual angle and I didn't know what it was. Let's go here. Oh, look at that. Look at this Pokemon over there. That's the weird fighting type with like six Pokemon at the same time. <laughs> That's fun. I wish I could get one someday. Smart Strike. I don't know what this attack is anymore. Is it steel? The user stabs the target with a sharp horn. Attack never misses. What? What is this type? What type is it? Smart Strike. It's steel type, yes. Nobody can learn it here. Okay. I didn't remember this attack. Okay, that's where I had to go, so let's explore something else. Let's explore another path. I like to, I like to explore everything before before taking the, the proper route. 
Okay, let's see what we got uh, this way. Oh, just a sign? Oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> Trainer tips. Checking out glowing Pokemon dance will give you some what? Oh, what did you say? What did you say? Wait, wait, wait. It's some interesting stuff. If you climbed all the way up here, you're likely to sort to investigate every nook and cranny. <laughs> That's exactly what I was saying earlier. I love when games do that. I love when games... When games know what you're doing and, <laughs> and and play with you on that. So keep that curiosity alive to search out every last den as you run around in the wild area too. <laughs> oh, it's like, it's like you know, I'm the type of player who talks to absolutely every every NPC. Oh, that's cool. I talk to every NPC and uh, like I talk to every NPC and there was this guy in one of the early towns. You talk to him and he says something along the lines of uh, uh, the sign that was there was indicating Pokemon Center to the right. So basically, instead of putting an actual sign in the game, they put a guy who mentioned the sign that was there before. I found that it's a little detail, but that's hilarious. I found that hilarious. That's very subtle. Very subtle joke. Like I mean, not subtle like you need to be smart to understand it, but it's not like an obvious slapstick joke you know it's like it's a very little detail that is totally unnecessary but that, that's still super funny oh my god i had those good thing is that they're quite slow so hmm i think i'm wondering this species ha only has females wait what is that yeah the species of vul vultures only has uh, females right and the species of the eagle only has males how do they reproduce then? Did they ever explain the game? Now I can see that the female... If you make it... Uh, if you breed it with another bird Pokemon... Uh, the female is still the vulture, so it will give a vulture. But the male... For the male, for the... Pixie plate, huh? For the male, I don't know how it works. I don't know how... Pokemon anatomy works. Lots of items here. That's nice. Trainer over there, so let's go there. A trainer over there as well. What's the actual way? Maybe this is the actual way. Let's go there then. Let's go this way. Hello there, adventurer. You can compare life to a journey, but the end of your life isn't the same as journey's goal. Huh. I didn't quite get that. <laughs> oh, drippy! That's the little... The little uh, dragon ghost. So cool. I love this Pokemon. It's so cool. I love the design. Like, the design of its final evolution. I'm such an idiot. I used fake out on a ghost Pokemon. I forgot it was ghost. Like, I literally just said it's ghost. One second later, I forget and I use fake out. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Oh, but wait. It's not a good idea to fight it with a uh, psychic type. But uh, yeah, whatever. It's a first stage Pokemon, so... It's kind of weak. That's fine. I would have been fine anyway. Vulbi. Okay, I hate this one. It's a... It's a dark type. Okay, it's a dark type, so... Disarming voice. Directly. Ooh. Pearl wind. Oh, it uh, chased me out, right? That's fine. I had... I could use two Pokemon in this fight, so... That's fine. Fine. Discharge. Whoa. That's a very cool looking attack. Very cool looking attack. Nice. Do I need to heal uh, someone? I think I'm fine, but... Uh, yeah, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. That's good. That's good. Let's keep going. Big nuggets. Can sell that for a lot of money money. Can I go where the Oh, do you see this? Do you see this hidden HM here? There? Hard to spot, but uh I'll get it. Why do I have so much trouble with uh, the name HM? It's not that hard. Only because in, in French we call it differently. Oh is it HM? No, it's not even HM, it's TM. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Oh my god, what this guy is so weird. 
He looks like uh, Borsalino from uh, One Piece. Oh, he has golden teeth. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, that's. <laughs> look at the fingers. That's what Japanese think Western rappers are. That's so racist. It's like you know when uh, when Japanese people uh, make have black people in their in anime or video games. They all look the same. All the black people look the same. <laughs> that's hilarious. They have no idea what they are supposed to look like. Alright, Psybeam. Oh, it's gonna be a long fight. I cannot switch. Zing Zap. Ooh, that's strong. Ooh, that's gonna be a difficult fight. I cannot switch. One on one, I cannot switch. I only have uh, ineffective attacks. It's gonna be tough. I can only hope the enemy is dumb. Felsinger, oh my god, that's a... That's a bug attack. Shit, alright. Uh, well, the best thing I can do is to just... Uh, yeah, do some side beams And hope for the best. Side beams and potion and hope for the best. Zing zap. I might use a... I might need to use a potion every... Every couple rounds. Why do I have so many potions, by the way? Did I fun? I'm supposed to have only 10. I must have found some uh, along the way, I don't remember. Mm, okay, that's fine, I can take it. It will be a game of attrition, but I can take it. Okay, another healing. Bit of a boring fight, but... Uh, <laughs> You gotta do what you gotta do to uh, to play by the rules and not lose anyone. Will I kill it with this side beam? I don't think so. I might need another one. Unless I have a critical strike. Oh no, it was fine. Ah. Oh, critical strike. See, see, see. Some brains there. Big brain. Big brain time. Level 40. My first Pokémon level 40, actually. Poison Jab. Is it a good one? I forgot. Yeah, but I'm not... Okay. So I got this tab with Tentacle, and also Poison. Hmm, actually... Could be good to uh, start with some Poison Jabs, and then... Uh, then finish them off with Venoshock. And my, my attack is not far from my special attack, so... Should I give up on Toxic? I don't know, at the same time, Toxic is a very... Very potent attack. Now mm. I might as well. Okay, if I need to use poison jabs and wait for the Venoshock to be poisoned for Venoshock, I might as well use Toxic and then Venoshock. No. Yeah, nah, nah. I think uh, Toxic and Venoshock is still a better, a better combo. Oh my God, his eyes are so weird. Why are some characters so weird? Alright, let's switch to Cornwall. It's your time to shine, buddy. <laughs> it's funny because <laughs> all of my Pokemons, I see them, I see them as uh, as kind of kind of people, you know? Like I don't know if you know what I mean, like characters, you know. I think Cornwall is the only one I see him oh shit. He's the only one I see as a pet, like as a dog. He looks so dumb and so goofy. I actually see him more as a dog than a, than a character or a person. That's that's pretty funny. Like I, I think he's dumb basically. The other ones I, I I imagine them as sentient. You know they have like a uh, feelings and stuff to stuff to. What the hell is that? Do I have to fight this one to get away to get through? I think so. The other one I feel they are like uh, I could converse with them as a trainer. You know. But Cornwall just looks like a big dumb dog. <laughs> That's why I love it, I guess. That's why I love it. Ooh, that's strong, actually. Maybe I can kill it with a Rock Blast. Or maybe not. <laughs> I should have used Bite. Maybe I could have uh, made him flinch. Rock slide, will I take it? I will take it. Uh, 
Is it 100% uh, accuracy? Yes, okay, good. Good. Yes. I was suddenly, I had like a panic moment, like, what if Crustal had some ability that make him survive somehow, and then he would uh, attack me and I would lose Cornwall. Thankfully, it didn't. <laughs> Certain panic moments. Only you can have in Nuzlocke. A big break! Oh, nice! I love this attack. That's so useful. That's so useful. Destroying the, the, the barriers. Let's see who can learn it. Nobody. But I'm sure someone else in my uh, PC boxes can uh, can use it. <laughs> oh, 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 do a battle. Do a battle. Wait, 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 wait. Is it like a... Wait. Uh... Cornwall, yes. No, I will do I will do the uh, Z and Cortex. Z because of uh, Bulldoze and uh, Cortex because of Bulldoze and uh, Z can avoid it. Let's do that. Is it like a, a boss and his secretary or something like that? I'm super cute, but I'm carrying super duper strong Pokemon. Succeeding as a businessman depends on communication. I get along perfectly with my Pokemon. Ah, let's see that. Colleagues, <laughs> just colleagues. <laughs> this kind of smug businessman. Okay, uh, uh, I'm not sure that <laughs> it was not uh, not a strong idea that I had here. Uh, but wait and wait and see. Let's see. Uh, can I see use Bulldoze? No, it's too dangerous. That two ground Pokemon that my I might lose Cortex. So let's use. Uh, I can keep Z. That's fine. Let's use Shadow Ball against uh, Hypodon. I feel like it's the most dangerous. And let's switch Cortex with uh, with Charlie's, I guess. Some strong water attacks would be nice. Oh, actually, uh, I could have done... Oh, uh, if I had used Bulldoze, I would have killed it. Because Bulldoze, I think, it does more damage if you are if the enemy is dig, uh, digging down. Oh, I didn't expect that crunch. Ooh, shit. Okay, let's use, uh, let's use Fly next. Let's use Fly. Let's get away from... From this, uh, from this crunch. Okay. Fly to... This one, yeah. I mean, it will be the next one then. And let's kill Hypodon because so far it's dangerous. Dig on this one, yeah, okay. Ooh, that's strong as well. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill it, right? Boom! Yes, nice. Critical hit, but I, could, I would have killed it even without that, I guess. Okay, so far so good. I'm getting away from uh, any potential attack. Well, that's so dumb because it would have died anyway. Now it's a safety measure, let's say. Safety measure. Perserker. Okay, okay. Uh, mm, I don't want to lose anyone. Uh, snipe shot. Snipe shot on Excadrill, yeah. Yeah, so anything I can do. Ah, fake out. Shit. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, good, good. I can switch. I can switch him for someone else before I die. Or I can, I can heal, I can heal uh, Charlie's before I get attacked. Okay, let's use a... Uh, let's, let's make use of Strength Sap to heal, to heal Zed. Leftovers, yes. And then I can, uh, I can reduce the attack of the enemy and then replenish my health with this, uh, the amount of attack it has. And I didn't know that attack existed. I don't know if it's a new attack for this game. I like it. Uh, let's heal Charlie's. Yeah. Heal Charlie's because uh, this dig would kill me. Definitely. Plus if the the other one Perserker attacks as well, I'm, uh, I'm fucked. Ho ho, good call, good call. Strength up, okay, let's see if he's strong. Berserker must have a strong attack, right? Lower the attack, yeah, and... 
Oh my god, that gives so much HP back. That's an amazing attack. That's an amazing attack. Thank you for the attack, uh, Rise. That's great. Oh my god, I, I think I cannot... I cannot win against Excadrill because he's gonna dig all the time. Uh... <laughs> Should I switch? But to who, though? Oh, oh, I know, I know. Right now, I can switch to... Uh... Okay, Wait, who did I use yet? Who did I use? I used the... Uh... Cortex, Z. Okay, I switch back to Cortex. Because then I can bulldoze this uh, Excadrill out of the way. I'll fight with the... Uh... Snipe shot against Perserker. Because Excadrill is probably gonna use Dig again. Not sure, but... Uh... Let's hit the sure target. Oh, I didn't expect the rock slide. Shit. Ooh, then if he attacks... I should have attacked... Uh, yeah, I couldn't know. I, I expected dig again. Okay, this one died. Good, 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 good. Whew. If he would have attacked me, that would have been very dangerous. Okay, and for the next trick... For the next trick, let's... Uh, Let's use Bulldoze and let's switch. Let's switch Charlie's back to Zed. Up, Bulldoze and everyone. And I switch to Zed. And then if it use, if the Excadrill use Dig, then he's fucked. So I think the damage will be doubled from uh, from Bulldoze. Yes, yes. I think that's a one shot here. It avoid the attack. Is Earthquake! Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. I thought Earthquake and uh, and Bulldoze work the same, like it would hit the target underground, but uh, no, it's just Earthquake. Okay, well, I learned something, I guess. Still, it's using, uh, probably using Dig against Zed, so it's gonna be ineffective. Come on! <laughs> oh my god. That's the one time you should not use the Quick Law, Cortex, come on! And then <laughs> everything failed and shit, I I unplugged my microphone. <laughs> uh. oh, oh my god. Cortex, Cortex. You have to use the quick slow to get faster, but not when you're supposed to attack second. And now you will miss because you will attack second again. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, see, look at that. Let's hope that the other one doesn't dig. Yeah, rock slide, good. Well, not good for that, but I can take it. Okay, finally. <laughs> ah, <laughs> this fight was harder than it should have been. <laughs> should have been much easier. I should be smarter. <laughs> oh, there's one more. Oh, I forgot. Okay, well. Oh, 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 you can have a, uh, can have a nasty. What did you attack the sphere, aura sphere, aura sphere, something like that? Uh, Cortex would die with that, so let me switch to uh... ah, Mr. Boots or Scott Pilgrim. Maybe Mr. Boots. I also fake him out because I expect I expect an aura sphere on Cortex. That would kill it. Because the special defense is shit. Let's see if I was right. If I made the right call. Also possible he sent something to Metal Claw. Okay, well. I was wrong. But uh, in the end it's fine because I'm gonna kill it anyway. Oh. I can... Oh, fake out. Fake out, obviously. Up and uh, Shadow Ball. Wait, wait! He might have this ability that makes him not, not scared. Ah, okay, no, that's fine. That's fine. No, I guess he was. No, he was too slow anyway. I'm so dumb. Fake out attack first, and then uh, Zed was faster anyway. I saw that earlier. Never mind. I panicked for nothing. Psy Shock. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Is it better than Psy Beam? It is. Takes physical damage. But I don't care. 
I never look at whether enemies... Well, rarely. I rarely look at whether enemies have more defense or special defense. So, it's equal to me. Your Pokemon are strong and cute. I sell this victory to you. I'm short on pocket change. Oh my god, that's so bad. The jokes of this game, and the jokes. God. Hello there. Did you a secret? No, I don't care. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Looks like a secret path here. Oh, look at that. Terrain extender. Huh. Cool, I never use terrain attacks, but... Uh, might be useful, I guess. Oh! Did they arrive to the next city already? I guess so. What was the point of this... Of this camping point, then? It was right next to the other city. Oh, it's not yet, not yet. Okay, that's a long route. That's a long route. Should I count it as several uh, areas? No, 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 right, no, right. Let's... It's still Route 8, one encounter, I had it already. But uh, what's great is that it's good for training. Hey, I want to fight you. It's good for training because you have a high level Pokemon in a, a wide variety of different areas. So I can always find someone. Oh shit. Good for. Good for Cornwall. I can always find some uh, wild Pokemon that I uh, can kill easily and get. A lot of XP while grinding. But that's good. Alright, cool. Uh, Brian, Rock Blast, which one? Uh, I like to start with Rock Blast and then go with Brian, but... but I can start with Brian directly, that's, that's dumb. <laughs> Look at that, nothing. Oh my god, I hate being burned. Good thing I used Brian because... The annoying thing with burn is that you lose some attack as well. I never understood why, to be fair. I guess they wanted to make it different from poison in a way. Just so annoying. Yeah, is Fire Fang the only thing you can do? It's kinda lame. Okay, next one. If there is a next one. Oh my god. So much damage. Boltoons. Alright. Should I keep fighting? I can keep fighting, I guess. Uh, let's use Dragon Breath a bit. I should survive the next... Uh... Aha, you can paralyze me. Ooh, ooh, that's shit. That's shit. Take that and get paralyzed. No? Come on. Okay, the hail, the burn. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. I can survive. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> that, you know the moment when you say, it's okay, I can survive? And in your mind, you're like, wait. <laughs> if I say that, it means I'm gonna die <laughs> in the next round, so... Let's be conservative here. Yeah, I would have survived. But, uh... Better safe than sorry, right? Oh, and now it's, uh... Now it's uh, below 50% health, so I can actually use Brine at full power. And hopefully kill it. Ooh. Dangerous, dangerous. Yes! Got him. I should have thought about the hail getting it at 50% HP. Should have thought about it. Beat you, Bobby. So creepy, Bobby. Your mom should be ashamed. Alright, now I arrive at the city. Cool. It's a snow city. Obviously. <laughs> what, what what kind of comment was that? Oh, the gym? I know, okay. I thought the gym entrance was those Roman columns, but... Uh, no. Cool. Okay, let's explore the city a little. Alright, everyone, that's it for this episode. I really like this route. It was eventful, it was challenging. That's exactly what I look for when I do a Nuzlocke. Uh, thanks for watching. If you liked it, leave a like and subscribe to support me. Follow my social media, especially Twitter. And I will see you in the next episode. Salut!